ladies and welcome to this week's power shot with of course the amazing wonderful the mind of ireland anna rooney and myself hanging on in the background there with everything i can offer paul reese and this week's this week's subject is how many times have you thought i'm done i'll get a job now, do you know what? This is this is such a sensitive subject as not many people will even come forward and say, oh, no, it's, it's one of those things we don't really want to talk about. But here's yeah, the thing. Wanna... Now, Paul, firstly, thank you very much. Oh, my God, that was a, some introduction, right? <laughs> yeah, it's a subject that I guess everybody's thinking about at some point, right? Especially the low, those low moments. Right. Me, including. I'm not saying that I didn't. Right. It would be a pure lie to say because having a business pushing and pushing and pushing is not a nine to five job. Right. It's not the time that you can take holiday and you've gone away without thinking about your business. So there are some times that you wonder, you know, how will you do that? Sometimes purely for time, you know, how to get that time in your head and physical time that you have how to match them. That's the way I look into it, you know. So, I, used to, I used to think at least at least 20 times a year. And then I then it reduced to like maybe 10 times a year, then five times a year. But I'm going to say maybe two or three times a year, I, I turn around and think, oh, should I get a job? It'll be much easier. But then <laughs> I look at, and here's the thing, I, I, I don't work five days a week. I used to work seven. Then I worked six, then I worked five, then I worked four. You know, I average three and a half, four days a week now. And so when I'm thinking I'm done, I'll get a job. Um, you know, I have to then look at, well, hang about, Paul. Well, why are you thinking that? Do you know what I mean? I think mine, mine mostly comes from a place of um, over the years not having the right, not having the right support system, feeling mm -hmm. lonely, um, the the inconsistency of money, sometimes yeah. being on less than minimum rate and sometimes being having more money than I, than I can enjoy. And that's that the beauty. Point. That's the beauty of entrepreneurship that not many will talk about. Right. But if you ask the biggest reason for me, and that comes when you have two kids, you know, and when you have to juggle so many things. So flexibility of time was my biggest reason why this whole thing started. Yeah. And then when you get into that, Routine is not the right word, but into that mindset of you can work very hard. Some days could be 12, 15, 16 hours. And I mean, literally mean that, right? You go to bed, you wake it up, you, you're back on again. But there are times that you can take that time. But you're right. Absolutely must. You need to have support systems and you need to have somebody who can back you if something, if for whatever reason you're not there. Maybe that's why I'm so big into collaborations, right? How else do you keep going? Because it is a lonely place. It's no other way of saying that. It yeah. is. And you have huge responsibility. You need to pay all your bills as well as try to pay yourself a wage, which you pay somebody else first before you pay yourself. So, yes. But support systems and, um, you know, people around you who are open minded and you know that they will support you and you don't need to talk to them every day a week but you know they're there for you. Yeah. And that makes a huge difference of when you doubt and I say, well, I go back to get a job or you actually keep going. Yeah, uh, yeah I'll take the second part. For yeah, and, and me too, because you use the thing that also keeps me going is I'm in charge of my money. Most people in a job, they live just over broke. Mm -hmm. Just over broke. That's what a job is. Now I got a choice with my money. There's no cap in, no ceiling. I can do what I wish. So that's another reason, but that doesn't doesn't stop me from occasionally with no. my tail in between my legs and and spit my dummy out and say, Do you know what? I think I get a job. Yeah, I think it's only healthy, Paul, because uh, you have those thoughts. You're evaluating where you are, and that pushes you more. And then you say, <laughs> Okay, the, this is the drive. Let's go another bit forward. You know, yeah, it's it's a question that. Uh, everybody thinks about but most avoid and when you avoid it that often that's another question right and it's, there, it's um, healthy isn't it Anna? it's healthy to sit down and sometimes feel sorry for yourself and think i'm gonna get a job 
actually no, <laughs> but I've thought about it. Yeah, I don't know if I will think of it spilling story, Paul, but I would say, is that a strategy I would like to take? <laughs> there it is, Anna Rooney. Thank you, love. It's been a beautiful, beautiful five minute deep dive, and we will catch you this time next week. Job or business, what be it? Oh, I think it's business here. So <laughs> happy days. Bye for now and boom. Bye for now. <laughs>